Hey, Chio Pal. For our market today, we're going to look at some Trailtopia chili mac with beef. Now, I bought this from Walmart.com, and I believe it might be an exclusive to them. Anyhow, let's take a look at it. Directions on this are pretty simple. Add two cups of water. Now, the uh, nutritional data is for two servings. So, it's actually 680 if you eat the whole package. And... Uh, 872 grams of sodium, 32 grams of cholesterol, and 30 grams of protein if you eat the whole bag. Wow, this is good till April 2025. Anywho's, let's rip her open and have a look inside. We think I can do it without spilling. Oh, wow, look at that. So, we got our uh, do not eat right here, easy to pick out. We got some beans, noodles. Now, it calls for a 15-minute rehydration time, and I'm going to guess it's because of all of those noodles. That is a lot of noodles to rehydrate. So I'm putting the full two cups of water they recommend in just because of all those noodles in there. It's going to probably use a lot of water. And if it's Chili mac and it's a little soupy, it's not the end of the world. Oh, I'm going to get a spoon and mix it up. We are about seven minutes into the 15 minute wait time. I'm going to give her another stir. But I brought you guys in just to see what she looks like. It's looking good. Although oddly, I don't smell any kind of seasoning that you would associate with a chili mac. Usually you get a nice pop of chili smell right off the top and I got nothing here. Although it does look good, we'll see if it tastes like anything. I'm quickly losing daylight, thanks to uh, this being the first day of daylight. Oh wow, that is a lot of food. Daylight savings time. Back again in the fall. Wow. That is a pile of pasta and beans. I hope the light, if I got enough light to pick this up, let me check. Here we go, I'm trying to get this shot with the uh, one tree that actually turned colors up here in the fall time. Bring it in close so you guys have a nice look of macaroni and cheese or chili mac that you've seen a hundred times before. You know what? I was about to take a big old bite of this. It still feels pretty hot in my hand. I'm going to take a small bite. Hmm. Well, what this guy tastes like is if somebody presented something and they said, what do you think? And they said, could you make it cheaper? That's what this tastes like. It's better than Wise Foods. It's not as good as Mountain House, and it's way less good than Packet Gourmet. I don't know that, uh, well, no, they wouldn't make, uh, Next Mile doesn't make a Chili Mac because they're keto. But anyhow, depending on the price, it's not terrible, but it's really just, they did just try to make it taste better by making it just a little bit spicier. At least they didn't just pump it full of salt. What you're eating is noodles that are barely covered with a mild amount of tomato sauce and just a wee amount of beef. And it gets the job done, but it's really not that much fun to eat.